Hello, 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 hello. How's everybody doing today? It's a beautiful day. It is Tuesday, June 22nd, 2021. This is an impromptu live that I wanted to do. So thank you all for joining me. Thank you all for those who will tune in later. Watch the replay. I appreciate you all so, so much. I just want to say um, I'm big on birthdays. You know, I think we should celebrate the lives of those that we are fortunate to know on this journey called life. Um, and this Thursday is my birthday. June 24th is my birthday. Yay to me. And I wanted to give back because it's always better to give than to receive. And um, I just want to share this amazing story that I wrote with you. And so I'm making it free to everyone, the ebook on Radio app. It is available on Amazon if you choose to get it there, but it's not free on Amazon. It's free right now until midnight, um, June 24th, which is this Thursday. You can get the book ebook for free on the Radio app. And in the description of this video is the link where you can download the app on Google Play Store. It's currently only available on the Google Play Store. The app is not available in the Apple Store at this time. But I wanted to just say thank you, thank you, thank you so much to everyone who encourages me when I'm writing these stories. Um, though I do write teaching books or nonfiction, I love fiction. I love to write about the things I dream of, the things that I see in visions, the, the things that I've learned along this journey called life. And all of my fiction, of course, is woven with the um, good news, as it were, or spiritual insight into different things. So someone has been asking me, how do you describe, or what would you describe my genre when it comes to fiction? And a beautiful author just left a quote. They read the book um, recently, and I did share that review on my page. And they said, suspense, I think it's suspense, paranormal meets sci-fi, something like that. So what do I write? I tend to gravitate towards writing suspense, paranormal, sci-fi, all three mixed into one. And I'm happy to say I'm on the journey of starting a new series. Yes, so far it's going to be a trilogy and it is going to dive into suspense paranormal sci-fi on a whole different level um i mentioned in i think a teaching that i did recently that for writers and authors you take a story that might have been told before and you do it from your worldview from your perspective and the series that i'm working on right now actually was inspired by this book though the characters are not the same and also by several things that I've watched. I don't know if you've um, seen any of the Tom Clancy um, movies that are out there. Um, also, you know, I'm a big sci-fi movie buff. I love science fiction movies, space movies, and things like that, though we all know there's no such thing. Oh, oops, did I say something? Okay, I'm just gonna stay on topic. Um, but definitely we do know that there is a spiritual aspect to life because we are spirit beings in a flesh body or in a flesh suit and so i tap into suspense science fiction and paranormal or spiritual things right when it comes to what i would consider science fiction it's more not it's not so much this going into outer space going into space crafts, as you would see like on sci-fi and whatnot, or like Star Trek, that's not the science fiction I'm talking about. It's the science of incorporating the um, spiritual things with the tangible things, knowing that this existence was spoken by the word of the Most High. Okay, so it's kind of like that, but listen, I'm not one to blow my own trumpet. 
But I'm going to say that this book even had me on the edge of my seat as I was writing it. I didn't know what was going to happen. Yes, I had my footnotes. I had my, my, um, I had my outline. I had everything. But when it came down to taking those bullet points and expanding upon them and making the chapter flush and listen, it had me going like, what? So those who have read it have expressed their um, deep, deep emotional attachment to some characters and some situations. And I did get a lot of cherished feedback so much so that I laughed at the intensity of the feedback. And I, I'm not going to give any spoilers. But again, as my birthday gift from me to you, I want to give this book free. It's the ebook. It's available on the Radio app, available in the Google Play Store. The link is in the description of this video where you can go and download it. And if you have read it, I have seen sales of this book already on Amazon as well as on the radio app if you've read this book please please leave a review wherever you purchased it um the book first came out in paperback and several paperbacks were sold it's now available in ebook and right now i'm really really looking for feedback i want to read your reviews i want to read the feedback tell me what you thought tell me what you liked, what you didn't like what made you just say earn what made you laugh what made you cry i as an author cherish those things because it lets me know that maybe you got the story maybe you got the plot you might also give me ideas for another novel that i didn't think of so it's very important and not just from me but anybody's work that you read please leave a review for the author and be honest okay if you didn't like it say you didn't like it but say why you didn't like it don't just say well it was blah and don't just say for example it could have been edited better because a lot of authors, unfortunately, don't have the funds to pay for professional editing, so they get the book edited the best way they can, okay? Especially for first-time authors and writers out there. So uh, kudos to anyone who's finished a book. If you never wrote a book, please be cognizant of your critiques because it takes a lot of determination to write a book, especially fiction because this is something that you're putting together. It's not you go and study with nonfiction and you compile works. Nonfiction is not very difficult to write. It's time consuming, but you have to be a real creative person, have structure and have determination to write a piece of fiction. So this is not gonna be a long video. I just wanted to say the book is now free on Radio App exclusively, the ebook, now until the end of my birthday this Thursday. If you have an iPhone, you can get it on Amazon. It's not free on Amazon, but you can get the ebook as well as the paperback on Amazon. I just want to say thank you again for all of you who support me. You, you have no idea how much that means to me, okay? Um, so yeah, that's all I have to say. And if you've read it, please, please, please leave a review where you purchase the paperback or the ebook. Please leave a review and a rating. Those help. Thanks, guys.